morning and welcome to the replay. How are you? Just waiting for the feed to come up. Should be any second now. There it goes. How are you guys? There we go. Let me just get my website in. Oh, stop it. Oops. It's moving so slow. Oh my goodness. Hi, Tanya. Hi, Mona. Hi, Cindy. Hi, Katie. Good morning, girlfriend. Hi, Brandy. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Susan Tapley. Hi, Joanne. How are you guys? Hi, Rayanne. I am so happy to be chalking. Good morning, Kara. Chalking and some coffee. And, of course, I forgot to fill the coffee up. Oh, yay, Katie. I'm so glad. Oh, the camper is so good. Um, well, today it's actually, sh it's sunny down here. It's a little windy, but I hear the seagulls, which always makes me think of summer. Um, we did have a small leak, which we are going to have to get taken care of, but we'll deal with that. I'm not worried. Good morning, Catherine. Good morning, Lisa. Glad to hear Brandy. Glad to hear Kathy. So today, good morning, Carol. I'm going to be making this sweet little stand-up easel sign for here. You know me, i got to have my little beach decorations. Why am I going to buy it when I can make it? There's no need to, to purchase others when I can do my own. Okay, i got to lift up the camera a little so you guys can see the bottom of this. Hold on. There we go. This should be good. Yay! And I'm going to do this now. If you are a brand new subscriber to me, you may not have any idea what I'm doing. So I'm going to show you what Chalk Tour is. Here's just a little bit of information for you. Good morning, Sylvia. Oh, perfect. Good. You can show the camera angles good now. Hopefully you guys have had a chance to read this. If not, once it is over, you can always go right back to it and pause it. But that's a little about Chalk Tour and what I'm doing. Good morning, Christy. So today I'm going to do Live Life in Flip Flops. I'm so excited about this transfer. I can't even tell you. Like this transfer speaks to my soul. This whole celebration suite, this entire thing, it's like they made it with me in mind. Good morning, Lori. How are you? Hi, Karen. Wow, there's a lot of people. Good morning, Lisa. There's a lot of people on this morning. I really thought I'd be like alone again. <laughs> Yesterday morning was really early though, so. Okay, so here are our silk screen adhesive back reusable transfers. As you can see, there's little white lines. We're gonna go ahead and cut on all of these because these are our cut lines because these are the individual pieces. Now I have to watch because the wind's blowing pretty good and I don't want my, my pieces flying all over the place because I'm sitting on the porch because the boys are sound asleep. i will be getting them up as soon as I'm done so we can go to breakfast. And I'm going to get to meet a sister chalker because I have something for her. It is a lazy Sunday morning, Susan. I love lazy Sundays. I actually slept until almost 8 o'clock this morning, which is crazy for me. I never do. Hi, Karen. Hi, Shelly. Yeah, I always have my coffee i have my coffee machine usually go off at six um down here and when i got up this morning my coffee machine was off and my coffee was made so i was like ah i overslept the uh the extended time cutoff which was not good <laughs> hi shelly hi debbie hello karen how are you okay so what i think i'm gonna do is i think i want to kind of have live life and flip-flops and then different flip-flops down here is what my thought process is going to be and then I think I'm going to go into the anchor um the anchor transfer and use some of the shells that's my thought process um I wish I had a little pair of like flip-flops like 
a bigger like charm pair and I would just glue it up there and then do all that but that's okay hi Debbie how are you so okay so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna do that right now I went on to look because I kind of like to good morning Amy I love to look and use colors that are like the colors of like the season oh Carol girlfriend it was raining here so bad you have no idea well you do you're in Florida so you know when rain comes it comes you know if when you get it you get it well, it was like flooding rain here for the last two days. It's crazy. I'm just so glad it's nice and sunny out, which is awesome. Hey, Shelly. So, um, I went on and looked up, I think they call, I don't even know how to say it, but the 2018 colors, okay? So, the only color I'm lacking that I did not have, but I'm going to maybe sub it with the emerald, maybe not, is um, it looks like our Thai teal. So, these are the colors that they are saying are the colors for summer for 2018 okay so I wanted to stick with that I'm a little bummed I don't have Thai teal with me I actually I can't believe I left it on my craft desk at home I wanted to pack it and left it but it, it is what it is so these are the colors that I'm gonna use somehow today okay I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do the live life and flip-flops probably I'm thinking I want to maybe do that in the yellow because I want it to be bright and bam right in your face our lemon yellow um, and then I'm going to do my flip-flops in a bunch of different colors. So that's going to be my thought process today. Hi, Teresa. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. It's, it's time. I need to live my life in flip-flops. So all I'm doing is um, writing on the back of the transfer because, as you read, these are reusable silkscreen adhesive back transfers, and we want to re-put them back on the right way on their carrier sheet. Okay? Live life. And I always, because I usually am working with multiple, whoops, with multiple transfers at once. Um, I like to notate the full name of the transfer instead of just back, only because, like I said, I use a bunch at the same time. If you don't use a bunch at the same time, just write back, you're fine. But when a lot of them have the same kind of design, if you will, um, which not really many have this cutout design, um, it gets a little difficult to figure out which one goes on which carrier sheet, okay? so. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to fuzz my transfer up. Now we need to do this to take some of the adhesive off for the first time when we stick it down because you know why? It's going to stick like crazy and I don't want that to happen. And don't mind my finger. Oh, I flicked the nail off the other day when we were opening up the camper. I can't wait to get back tomorrow night and get my nails done now. Oh, but it hurts so bad. Anybody that gets the acrylic nails, you, you feel my pain. I know you do. Hi, Tanya. All right, so we got live life and flip flops. Let's get this on. All righty. Now, as you guys are coming in, I would love it if you would share my video. Bottom left hand side of your mobile device is a share button. All you got to do is click it. I would love it. I'm trying to eye up where the center might be. I think that looks to be pretty good. Now, we want to make sure that we have no bumps inside the silk screen area. I don't care if I have bumps outside, like over here, or over here, it doesn't matter. I care about bumps in the silk screen because that's where I'm gonna put the chalk paste at, okay? Pull that down a little bit. Now, what did I say? Lemon. So we're gonna use some lemon for this. Now, here's our chalk paste. Oh, I love that it smells like baby. You guys probably laugh at me every time I say that. Okay, but we gotta stir it up. Now, I use stirry sticks. We don't wanna use wood because if you are using wood, you are gonna pull the moisture out of the chalk paste and make it dry quicker, okay? Now, I don't know why I do this. I'm a little anal. Hi, good morning, Michelle. Um, I'm a little crazy with this, but I like to add a little bit of water. For me, I feel like it gives me, <laughs> you don't have to do this. You don't want to do this all the time. I feel like it makes me have just a little bit of wiggle room with moving because you want to make sure you get your chalk paste on relatively quickly okay so I'm gonna use one of our small squeegees that had some dried up chalk paste on it <laughs> um, and I love the small squeegees and our new three ounce containers because the small squeegee fits perfectly in there okay so I'm just gonna stick it in and I'm gonna get some chalk paste and pull it out right and I'm gonna just pull right on down my transfer just like this okay see how easy this is easy peasy anybody can do this you can have a craft skill level of zero and be able to pull this off okay 
I've had people say, oh, I don't think I can do it. Uh, yeah, you can. You wanna know why I know? Because my five-year-old nephew came down here last year and we made a sign. I helped him literally for like a second. And he made a cute little sign to take home to his mom. Okay, so seriously, anybody can do it. Now all I'm doing is making sure I get all my lines off, which I did. I'm gonna get all of this excess and plus it, put it right back into my container. And I did get some on my fingernail, which we don't wanna make sure we get that off. And then I'm gonna just gently peel my transfer off, okay? Peel to reveal. This is a, not necessarily awkward, it's just, oh shoot, you know what I didn't do? I forgot water. How do I always manage to forget water anymore? It's like my brain isn't turned on. There we go. Live life in flip-flops. Now, I went off a little bit there, you'll see. Good morning, Patricia, good morning, Judy. I went off a little bit, but I'm gonna show you how we're gonna clean that up. Hold on one sec, let me just get some water. I can't believe I did. Okie dokie. Now we've got our water. Okay. Kind of pull it to the side here so that way I can reach it. Move my chalk paste out of the way. There we go. Sitting in water. Good. Now, next part. We're going to use the little layers of the flip flops and we're going to make. I'm gonna make like a chain of them along the bottom. Hi, Eileen, good morning. Oh, good morning from Smithfield, Virginia. Patricia, we just drove through Virginia last week. Okay, so I'm gonna close up my chalk paste. We don't wanna leave it open. And I'm actually gonna get this goop right off here on the side. I don't wanna move the hard and crusty into my chalk paste. Oh, making a mess. Making a mess as per usual. Okay, so we got the hard and crusties away. Yay. Oh my goodness. Made a mess. Made a mess. Stop. Okay, so let's just stick this off to the side. Put that in there. Put our squeegee in the water and let's move on, huh? Now, good morning, Doreen. Good morning, Nancy. Good morning, Rhea. Good morning, Sue. Good morning, Mayor. Okay, so let's get, like I said here, right here I went off a little bit. Good morning, Amanda. Oh, hot and humid in Arkansas. We're supposed to be hot. I don't know about humid, but we're supposed to be hot today. 81. Now it's starting to feel like May. Finally, there we go. All the excess that I got on there when I was trying to peel my transfer off, gone. Look how good that looks. Live life in flip flops. Oh, I love it. Okay, let's make sure it's dry. Morning, May. How are you, girlfriend? Okay, we're dry. Ooh, Alabama. Good morning, Rhea. Okay, so now we've got multiple layers of flip-flops, right? So I'm gonna call this shadow because this looks like a shadow layer to me, which we'll use. See how that kind of looks like it's the outline of the flip-flops? This is dots. Because remember I said you kind of want to label it not just back because look, all of these are like the same shape, right? Chevron. And then this one is just, we're gonna just say plain. Okay, so we're all done labeling. Now it's time to play with flip flops. All right, so I think what I'm gonna do, good morning Casey, good morning Bobby. 
I think what I'm gonna do, good morning Susan, is I know I'm gonna use for this little shadow layer, I'm gonna do a white on that. Cause I think that'll look really good, okay? But I don't wanna do that part first. I think what I'm gonna do is possibly layer down with this because then we can do polka dots and then we can do chevrons. So I think what I'm gonna do is do my layers in, because I'm gonna have to stop to keep cleaning them. Maybe I'll just do them all in white and then just do the different shadow layers. That's what I think. Oh, I'm great, Meg. I'm down back at the camper. It's I'm loving life here. I'm a happy girl. I can't complain. I can't complain at all. I cannot complain. There we go. Let's get our pieces off here so that way we can fuzz them. Because sometimes I get excited as I get to the end and I forget to fuzz. And we don't want that to happen. Okay. The boys are still sleeping, which gives me chalking time to hear the birds and the wind and enjoy the sunshine. Hi, Joanne. Hi, Christina. Hi, hi, Danielle. Okay. So we've got, Danielle, this should be speaking to your soul as well. <laughs> All right. So let's start off with, I'm trying to think if I maybe alternate between <clears throat> I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a few with this. Let's see if this is going to work out for me. I'm hoping it does. Oh, that needs to be fuzzed up some more. Yes, Judy agreed. I woke up this morning and I was like, oh my gosh, it's birds and sunshine. Birds and sunshine. Yay. All right, so let's try this out. I'm gonna see how this is gonna work. I kinda wanna like start high, go low, you know, like make them look cute. Like a little chain, a little chain of flip-flops here. So let's start off with some white chalk paste. Kinda just gonna play around and see how I go. Okay, this white is perfect. There is zero water needing to be added to this. See how it looks like, God, it smells so good. Um, See how it looks like marshmallow fluff? That's what we want. We want marshmallow fluff. Look. All right, so let's do this first, shall we? Let's get a little bit of chalk. We don't need a lot of chalk paste on this at all. See how little this silk screen area is? Super tiny. Super, super tiny. Okay. that excess off don't waste any then peel it back take your time to peel oh my god I love the shadow of this <gasps> all right now I'm gonna kind of put this to the side I did a very clean transfer of this meaning I got all my excess off so hopefully it won't dry in my um it won't dry hi Aunt Renee it won't dry in my silk screen Danielle I know all you saw was flip-flops heck yeah girlfriend it talks to us um Oh, I love our camper, Judy. Oh, this was the best decision we ever made. Going to use a lot of my products this coming week. I'll be introduced to October to about 15 of our friends. We can... Oh, yay, Doreen! That's awesome! I can't wait to hear about it. That's amazing, girl. That's awesome. All right, now let's make sure this layer is all dry. Okay, get the board back to room temp. I want to make sure that it's... Not so hot. I think what I'm going to do is alternate between this layer and the plain flip-flop layer. And I think what we'll do is we'll add. That's kind of what my thought is going to be. And then we can do the different colors in between. I'm hoping I have enough room to do. You know what I probably should do? Because it'll go shadow layer, plain, shadow layer, plain. Up, down, up, down. So I'm going to do these over here and try and get, leave as much room as I did with... Oh, nope, nope. That's about as much room, I think, as I left on 
that end looks to be at least okay no um, bubbles in my silk screen get a little bit of chalk paste do the same thing pull the color over your silk screen area leave no bumps or um, no lines rather and if you leave no lines you know you're doing a nice clean pull so that should leave no chalk paste in your silk screen okay oh my gosh that looks so good it looks awesome let's see if I keep doing this Hopefully I did not get any bubbles in that because I did not push it down correctly, but that's okay. If I did, guess what? Oh, I do have a bubble. If I do and it shows through, no big deal. Guess what? This comes off with water. I'm not concerned. I'm not worried. Okay, get my excess off. I see a little bubble, but we'll see what happens. I don't look so bad. Can't really tell. I'm going to leave it. Okay, so I'm going to get this in water. And then I'm going to go ahead and heat this up. I may have put too much room. I hope I have enough room for the other little layer. We'll see. I might have to move this over. We'll see what happens. Hi, Elaine. How are you? Cindy, it's just this sweet little easel board that my husband actually picked up for me when he was out. I love that he looks for me. Um, where did he say he got it? Uh, I'm going to be honest with you. I feel like it may have been Target. Oh, that's definitely too close. But that's all right. It's all right. I'm still okay with it. I'm still going to be all right with it. I really don't don't mind so much. All right. Now, let's hope that my chalk paste goes on through cuz like I said, I think I left I didn't I don't think I left any thing in the silk screen. I think I had a nice smooth transfer the first go around. Get my excess off. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Okay, get that in the water. Can't reach. Sorry about my head, guys. Can't get it. Can't reach. And you know what? I'm okay with this, with the little excess being here. You know what? Maybe I'll put a little starfish or something in there. That'll be super cute. I absolutely could. Absolutely, Susan. Toes up, toes down. Toes up, toes down. Oh, wasn't that awesome, Elaine? Big Brand was not amused, neither was Little Brand, but I was. I thought it was adorable. I really did. That's Little Brand's favorite place to go down in Florida. He loves playing a Hollywood. He loves all of the movie nostalgia and seeing all the things in person. That's just, it's just the kiddo's thing. He loves it. Okay. So you know what I think I'm going to do? I'm going to do, we want some lime green. We want some red orange. I think some pink and some purple flip flops. I think that's the way I'm going to roll today. So let's do some white and lime green chevrons first, right? Well, that'll look so good. And I think what I'm going to do is maybe um, clean off the plain pair. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. I am, Kara. We have a little porch um, off the front of the camper. So yeah, I'm sitting outside on the porch. And what's funny is that though, um, when I am doing lives, if people are happen to be walking by, um, it kind of looks like I'm talking to myself, but I'm actually not right at the moment because I'm talking to you guys. But yes, um, it does. I hear the seagulls, I hear everything at the breeze. It's gorgeous, it's a gorgeous morning. So happy. Okay, so now for this layer, all I'm gonna do is try my best to line up the little thongs for the flip-flops. I just wanna make sure I make sure this is really fuzzed up good. Hi, Amy, how are you, girl? 
Did you get your kit yet, girlfriend? I think you said it was coming, was it yesterday or is it Monday? I can't remember when you said it was due to come. Okay, that seems lined up pretty good. Look at that, actually. Guys, that was a really good job of lining that up. Okay, so now let's do the first set in, well, purple's my favorite color. Let's do, no, you know what, let's do lime green. Let's get some lime green on here. Oh, that's perfect. Look at that, look how good that looks. Oh yeah, that mixed beautifully. Okay, and I'm gonna just use, this is a small squeegee, a piece of a small squeegee cut in thirds. I'm gonna just use that because it's a little itty bitty area. Don't trip, okay. Whew. Tripped at the right time. Thank goodness. Way too much chalk paste, Jess. Way too much. A little area. What was I doing? Now you're going to see, I don't know if you guys can see, there's some like little streaks. But all I'm going to do, it's the organic pigment. I'm just running my fingers over it, and then I'll pull it again. If that happens, just run your fingers around in it, and it'll be totally fine. It'll disappear. It's because our chalk paste comes from, like I said, an organic pigment. And um, that can happen. Oh, my gosh. How stinking cute. <gasps> I love it. Oh my goodness, so adorable. <gasps> okay, that's so cute, I can't take it. All right, let's get them in there. All right, now let's move on to another color. Get my stuff in the water. Now let's do some, how about some purple polka dots? Yay, Amy, so glad. See, I would be too picky and have to move the middle two to make them look uniform. I know. Well, you know what? I usually will be like that, but I'm not going to do it today. I'm okay. I'm all right. I'm going to live life in flip-flops and just be free. <laughs> all right. So next one is going to be our polka dots. Whoa, that was wet still. Hold on. Jumping too far ahead. I'm going to wind up throwing in my flip-flops. shaken. Well, that lined up really good except for the bottom. Try again. And sometimes you, you know what, it's okay if you have to try a few times to line it up. Or you can just say, you know what, it is what it is. See, it's so sticky still right there. I need to fuzz it again and again and again. There it goes. Okay, now let's try it. And what stinks is, this is why I don't like to have nails. I'm going to be honest with you. It's one of those reasons. Let me turn it sideways. Maybe I'll be able to see it better. Where are my glasses? So the depth is a little off. I'm trying to line the side up because I know if I can get the side of the flip flop lined up, I know I'm golden.
This is where I wish Bram was up. Without nails and have him help me. <laughs> ah, it's hard when you have nails trying to do this. It's not easy. And because of the placement, you know what, maybe we'll try, let's try down here. Let's try over here first. Make me lose my mind over there. See, it was just me trying to get it along the bottom of the board. Look at that, first try it lines up. Hey, that's, that's, uh, that's gonna be easy now. See, cause this one was so far down. Oh my goodness, I stink. I am just stink, stink, stink. Hi, Lisa. Girlfriend, don't miss out on getting your camper. Oh, boy, this guy needs a little bit of help. No, actually, he doesn't. He's perfect. All righty. There we go. Hi, Mary. How are you? All right, now let's get our polka dots on. It's gonna be so cute. Yeah, see how easy it was to line up once I wasn't directly at the bottom? That was my problem there. All that excess off. There we go, no lines, perfect. Excess off my chalk pee, off my squeegee, and pee. oh, how cute are they? <gasps> Look at the white and purple polka dots. I would wear those flip flops, I'd wear them in a heartbeat. How stinking cute! Okay, now you know what I think I'm gonna do. I'm going to. Hold on. Make a giant mess with yellow chalk paste that just dropped on the ground. Awesome. Hi, Cassie. Hi, Denise. How are you? Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to clean. Oh, my gosh. Please stop blowing wind. Hold the phone. We're, we're about to have a catastrophe. Okay, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back in and move these over slightly and put them in a different color. I think I'm going to do pink flip-flops there. And then I'm going to come back and do red, orange, chevrons. So let's clean those two. Let me show you guys how I'm going to do that. I'm going to do a quick clean. Okay. So what did I say? I need the plain flip-flops and I need the chevrons. Okay. I think you guys should be able to see. Yes, Target. Okay, that's where he got it. Good morning, Denise. I am glad, yeah, get it, girl. You'll love this. This one is so cute. Okay. Okay, I'm using just a Lysol wipe to get all the excess off the front of my transfer. Then I'm gonna flip it over and run the Lysol wipe across the back and as you can see it's already starting to get sticky because it's sticking to my hand pretty good Now remember I said we're gonna do a quick dry. I really don't like doing this Because I don't I'm worried. I'm gonna get stuck with some little pieces of paper towel on the back, but Let's see Ah, It's okay, Judy. I am gonna move it over though <laughs> Once I realized that I wanted to have a, so a solid pair of flip-flops I was like, oh, I gotta have that. I gotta move that over a little now, which is good, it's no biggie. Okay, so while I let these dry, I'm gonna show you guys how easy it is when you make a mistake to just fix it. It's not a big deal. Really not a big deal. That's the awesome part. Okay, oh, that's super sticky again. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray some water and Get this moved over. 
and in a different color. Now I'm just gonna take my time and do this so I don't inadvertently go into the one that is completed that I like. Okay. I don't have my big water sprayer with me. I left it at home, which is probably pretty good because, ooh, I almost went right into that other one. I'm gonna try to see if I can, I'm actually not gonna spray that. Who am I kidding? If I do try to spray that, you know what's gonna happen? It's gonna go right into the other one and I don't want that to happen. So I'm just gonna take my time. I'm not in a race here. Now I will tell you something I noticed with these little boards here. Hold on, let's see if I can just hope to God. Yes, okay, good. Um, they are definitely not a good quality board. Obviously nothing like Chuck Tour board because they are staining it and I'm seeing shadows. So thankfully, I do have a Mr. Clean um, brush here, or a Mr. Clean um, Magic Eraser with me. Don't blow wind, stop it. My transfers are gonna fly everywhere, hold on. Ay, ay, ay. I remember the last day, the last weekend that I, I chalked here. Oh my goodness, the transfers were all over the place. They were everywhere. Get our magic eraser here. Let's try to get off some of this shadow layer here. Okay. I'm gonna stand up and do this so I don't run it into. Much better, but I can still, oh yeah, now it's gone. Okay, it's, well, no, it's still there a little bit, but it's not as bad. Okay, great. Now, let's go back in and let's finish this up. Hi, Cheryl. Hi, Tracy. There it goes. Okay, so now, this is pretty dry. Hi, Danielle. Now let's come in and let's just make a plain, color flip-flop here. And I think I want them to be pink. I think pink will look good. Or should I have them be orange and do pink chevrons? Pink, orange, I think orange. I'm going to do the red orange. Oh boy, maybe I'm not. Let's see how this looks. That may not be happening today. Oh, my red orange is dried out. Womp, womp, womp. We are not going to use red orange today. Nope. I think this was my old one. And I feel like I may have put it back into my container. Like a goofball. All right, so you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna use aquamarine instead, and we're gonna do pink flip-flops and then aquamarine chevrons. That's where we're gonna roll today, guys. All right. Ooh, my bubble gum is perfect. Look at that. It smells good, too. Hi, Sherry. Hi, Stacy. How are you, Stace? Miss you. Hi, Patricia. Okay, you ready? get our pink, our Pepto-Bismo pink flip-flops down. I have a pair of flip-flops this color. Actually, it's kind of funny. And I used way too much chalk paste there. Wow, what was I thinking? All that excess off, guys. I used a lot of it. Okay, got that down. Perfect. There it goes. Get it in the water. Alrighty. So let's let that dry. 
love it. Flicking pink chalk paste everywhere. Hi, lovey. How are you? Oh, my favorite too, Mary. Hi, Sherry. Good morning. I'm glad you missed me, Stace. We gotta get together, girl. <clears throat> okay, so let's heat these pink flip flops up. <gasps> Just had a chalk booger from the red orange go into my pink flip flop. <coughs> <coughs> Darn it. It's okay though. It's okay. Okay, let's let that cool off a little bit. It's pretty warm. Okay, let's get our aquamarine. Actually, what we can do is while we're waiting, let's get aquamarine ready. <coughs> Looks so cute. Aquamarine up nicely. God, I love aquamarine. Aquamarine and tight teal. Caribbean was my favorite. Then it retired. Womp, womp, womp. Okay, ready? And like I said for this one, remember we're going to, still a little warm right here. Okay, we're going to line up the little thong of the flip-flop and that's how we're going to determine that it's going to line up correctly look at that super easy see i think the only reason why the dots gave me such a hard time over here is because it was so low otherwise it's not hard guys it's really easy to do okay so now we got our aquamarine coming oh i love this color brand big brand likes this color too he likes that it matches the transfer he says it every time. It disappears. They're mowing lawns since it's actually dry. Okay. Oh, now I wish I had a pair of flip flops that look like this. How cool is that? Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. You know what we should do on this on the pink flip-flops we should do white polka dots what do you guys think do you think that would look adorable or what I think we should they're too bland I need something with them we're gonna do that let's close up aquamarine see I love how they're reusable see guys like this was I just I pretty much showed you a little bit of everything on this video today showed you how to clear up a mistake <laughs> I showed you how to um, how we can relayer and layer. Uh, showed you how to clean up a a kind of. This was is a cheapy board, guys. This is why I I love our chalk couture boards because the little mishap with the white where it was showing a shadow doesn't happen on our boards. Our boards are awesome, and the cute little magnet shapey boards came back in stock we have the white circle we have the black 10 inch square we've got the vertical um bracket one we've got the 18 inch round it's awesome oh, they're coming by sorry it's gonna get loud for a second thank you amy hi lisa hi debbie it is perfect for the short space oh you know what they're not mowing you know what they're doing guys they're dragging the chain around the, the campground because there's like flooding in the mud, so they gotta move it around. It's pretty good. I love my campground, guys. These guys rock here. King Nami. Okay. Oh, look, that came out. Yay. Oh, wait a second. Remember I said why I didn't? I'm in the same predicament with the flipping dots again. That's why I didn't do it at first. Mm. All right, let's see how well I can get it to line up. Let's just try. I think maybe the secret is gonna be to get the, guess what? That line? Oh, nope. Hold on. I'm determined to get this. I will get it. It will not defeat me. It will not.
him flipping determined. something here guys I'm working something it's like this heel if I could just get the heel to line up right Shoot, did I just let that in? guess what it works yay we got it woohoo all right what do we say white polka dots I know right I know right Susan but it's quiet hours are up eight o'clock quiet hours are up 11 p.m. to 8 a.m. are quiet hours. Okay, let's get our little dots on our pink polka dot. Flip-flops. So stinking cute. Okay, get our excess off. Peel this puppy off. Um, they're adorable, and I want a pair of pink and white flip-flops with polka dots. Look at that. Look how stinking cute that turned out. <gasps> oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, I can't wait to put this up. Live life in flip-flops. And then, like I said, I think I'm going to do some shells over here. I think I might do actual real shells and hot glue them to the board. I think that's what I'm going to do. And I do have some cute little rope, the like nautical rope. Ooh, I can add that as well. But I don't have my hot glue gun here, so it's gonna have to come home with me to get finished. Do you guys love it? Isn't it so cute? Hold on, let's see if I pull this down, if you guys can see how adorable the pink flip flops are. Let's see. Can you see that even better? Oh my God, you can see them adorable, I love them. Yay, hi Michelle, hi Karen. Thank you Brandy, hi Susan. Oh, I love them. So cute. All right, guys. So that is how we're going to live life in flip-flops. Isn't it? Oh, just the cutest, most sweetest transfer ever. Love it so much. I hope you guys, um, my website is the pinned post down below. If you want to get your hands on this transfer, please do it. I love it if you would. Um, also, if while you were watching this video, you had said to yourself, hey, I'm pretty interested in getting some of this stuff. Why don't you, and you, if you are not a consultant, you can comment me down below and I will message you the link to get into my VIP group. If you were watching this and said, wow, I really could see myself doing this. I know a lot of people that would love it. I want to do sip and chalks. Come and join down below and I will message you the link to my opportunity group where I have a video that tells you everything you need to know about becoming a designer and all about chalk couture. Okay. So um, if you are coming in late, I would love it. Thank you, Susan. Hello, Karen. Um, I would love it if you would share my video. Bottom left hand side of your mobile device is the share button. But otherwise, guys, I hope you have a great Sunday and I will see you later.